If you live in Seattle or the area and your child needs surgery, I'm the person you want to see in the ER in the middle of the night. I really enjoy taking care of children and offering them what I know from a surgical standpoint and being able to help them and their families. I perform pediatric general surgery. Within that field, I specialize in pediatric intestinal failure. First, you have to recognize how significant it is for a family to have a child go through an operation. A groin hernia to us is something we do very, very commonly. But for a family to bring the child in early, even to have the child go four or six hours without eating, to undergo general anesthesia and then to have surgery, not to mention the post-op recovery is a big, big deal. So I think recognizing it is paramount. And then having my own children and having had one child need a, a procedure here has made me realize just from a personal standpoint how important and how significant it is. We do a lot of counseling, a lot of discussion, and we don't take any of these operations for granted. We learn from our patients all the time. That's how the whole field of medicine is, is set up, really. As much as you think you know, you're going to come across a patient, for me, either in the ER or the OR or the floor or the clinic, that has something unexpected, and you learn from all of those. The other passion from this job is the intersection of clinical and research. Some of our research has shown when the optimal time is to refer patients with intestinal failure to a, a rehabilitation program like what we have here. We're also on the leading edge of studying the long-term outcomes of these children, making strides clinically, but also studying it from an academic standpoint is a challenge, but I think it's something that I really enjoy and something that brings me into work every morning.